Hello, how are you guys? Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night, Mercy. Good night, Juancito. Good night, Mr. Mel Miguel Franco. Hello. Ha ha. You couldn't get in, right, Tati? I'm here right now. Uh -huh, I know. And you couldn't get in because, uh, to be honest with you, I was in another um, group and I hadn't finished, but now I did. Hey, thank you. So I have here uh, Angel. I do have Iris. I have Tani Tiatie. I have Janet. Mr. Rafael Herrera. Very good. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. good evening, sir. Hey, Mr. Alejandro Plates. Yes. Ms. Rebecca Bijalta. Oh, hi. Hello. All righty. Very good. We have Rachel. Okay. Lester. Hello. Rebecca. Yeah. Miss Janira Garcia. Nice to meet you. Woohoo. Excellent. Alex Cornejo. Yay. Hey, you're in a Hello, different place right now. How are you, sir? <laughs> Very good. good. Yeah. Juancito. Hey, how are you, sir? Excellent. Yay. Very good. Okay. We had a lot of guys here. Oh, hey guys, how's your day going so far? So far, is it good? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Very okay. good. Very good. Oh, that's nice to hear, Johnny. Hey, very good. Let me double check. Who can help me? Okay. Uh, Alex, thank you, Alex. You're so nice. You always are really, really to, <laughs> to participate in today's class, right? Okay. Yes. Alex, tell us a little bit about yourself uh, or, or uh, what happened to you today. How was your day? Uh, it was nice. You know. oh, really? What, what did you do? Mm, um, early in the morning, I woke up at 5, Oof. 5 30. Wow. Yeah. I got ready to get dressed. You got dressed, okay. Yeah, I was ready to go to work. Mm -hmm. And then I, I arrived to my job around. 7.45. 7.45, okay. Ooh. Yeah. Did you drive? Did you take the bus? I, I took the bus, yeah. Oh, you took the bus, okay. Yeah. And then I started to work. What and is the first thing that you do as soon as you arrive to work? Do you have breakfast or you or turn on your computer and start checking your emails? Yeah, turn on the computer and... Because uh, I do like a uh, cashier, you know. Oh, okay, that's good. Yeah. Uh, do you so, work in a bank? No, really. It's a it's a bar shop. It's a um, bar shop. No, uh, uh, her, her, how do you say? Do your best. Auto do your best. Automotive auto auto shop. Ah, that's great. That's great. Yeah. Ooh so this um like cashier, you know. The yes. Regular. But it's really interesting. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. And sometimes I'm like salesman also. Oh, okay. Sales, yeah. And then I spend uh, like for eight hours mm -hmm. all day. And I have the lunch. I'll yeah, have the lunch. lunch. Okay. Yeah. Did you prepare your lunch or did you buy something there? Uh, I usually buy some, something there. You know? Something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you cook? Yeah, I like to cook. Oh, oh. okay. Yeah. You know what? I wish we could have a live class so we can taste Mr. Cornejo's um, cuisine, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, that would be wonderful. Very nice. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. It's not because <laughs> I'm saying, but it's my my food are really delicious. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, but I, I like, you know. Really? I, Tell us something. What is your favorite dish that you said? Oh, it's not because I did it, but this is you know, the last The last Sunday, I, mm -hmm. I, prepared, I cooked uh, a chicken with mushrooms. Mm, wow, well, oh, interesting. You know? you look, look at Alejandro plays it like. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's nice. You just put uh, some. Listen, pota potato. You, you, you should take notes, okay? <laughs> Uh -huh. yeah, you prepare the chicken with some season. Uh 
And you season it, okay. Season it, and then you fry it, and then you put uh, some, uh, after that, you put uh, the, the cream, mm -hmm. the mushroom cream, and you add milk, and some potatoes, mushrooms, and then you cook. That's it? Yeah. Yeah. Wow, that's and amazing. Nice. That sounds yummy. You know what, Alex, talking about your recipes, I remember the last curse I had. Um, a, uh, yeah, I do have basically a, one of our students who actually gave me his recipe about bean soup. Yes, yeah. yeah, and he said that he prepared, he uh, started telling us uh, the ingredients and the steps as, as, as you did, right? But um, he said that he adds some Lorocco to the bean soup. And I said, Lorocco, I had tried Lorocco in the chicken soup, right? But in the bean soup, never in my entire life. Okay, so I decide to follow his recipe. Okay, and the next time I added some Lorocco, and can you know, from now on, I always add Lorocco in the bean soup because it's really good. I could right. never imagine that a loco goes well with bean soup, never, but it is. So you should try that. Interesting. Yeah, it's really interesting, Angel. It's really interesting. Yeah. So I add all the ingredients, right? I like, I add juca, I, like, I added, um, I don't add carrot because carrot is really sweet for me. No, 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 uh, I no. did add a uh, whiskey, pipian, uh, cabbage, yeah. uh, cilantro. I think uh, what else? Uh, uh, corn. Uh, what else? Uh, al al capate, <laughs> right? That's what it is. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I hopefully pronounce it correctly. And uh, what <laughs> else? Uh, 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 well, of course, right? And the meat and uh, onion and uh, garlic. Okay, and everything. And it's really good. And you prefer a, a rice, right? A rice pot, right? And avocado, right? And chili. Oh. Yeah. And cream. Oh my God, that's amazing. Nice. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. And I'm not going to continue because I will start having being hungry. Okay, <laughs> okay, very good. So that's nice. That was really nice job. Thank you, Alex, for sharing okay. your Thanks. recipe and your day. Okay, let's listen. Jeanette, what about you, girl? How's your day going? Hi, hey, good evening. Good evening. Um, was very busy. Busy? Why? What happened? How many, how many meeting with the uh, mm -hmm. into new course? Okay. Uh, any uh, have many work with days with mm -hmm. the student with fathers. Um, my my job uh, is more document. Paper. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, this takes me a lot of time. I know. Uh, come back very late to home today. Ooh, at what time? Uh, uh, for me, late at uh, 8 p.m. Oh, well, but it's late. Yes, it is. Oof. Eight. Yeah. But do you already have your uh, um, dinner? Yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Cool. First, was the first when back to home. Very good. <laughs> the first, and have worked every every day in morning with my co-workers. I need um look what they will do in the day. Mm -hmm. So, is the repeat repeat the same things all days. Oh, okay, so is is your daily routine all? Is your daily routine? Yeah, it's routine. Okay, yes. okay. got it. This made me uh, stress. I know. I feel you know, stressed. you know what happens? I I told my uh, one of my friends. He's a doctor, and I told him, you know what? I'm really tired t today. And I told him last week on Friday. I've I'm my mind is really busy, right? Because I work. And I also have you guys every every day, and I love you. Of course, it's not because of you, right? Right? It's because it's, it's a lot of information and a lot of things for me. But I told him, you know what? Today my mind is really is um. Well, it's busy, but I feel like a zombie right now. <laughs> and he said, yeah, I did. And he said, yeah. well, he was start laughing like, <laughs> like, hmm. 
<laughs> okay, so he said, you know what? Take a, take a rest and then you can do two things. You can uh, watch a movie or you can go out and do exercises. So of course, I, I picked the first one, right? <laughs> okay, so yeah. and, and I sent him like, a, like an audio message. And I told him, yeah, finally, I was out of my meeting. Okay, so I bought a Coke. Can you imagine? I, I never drink a Coke. Well, it depends. Sometimes I need a Coke. So I said, ah, today I'm going to drink Coke. Okay, so I bought a Coke. I bought a, a popcorn that you can do in the microwave, not the way that you yeah. do it naturally because I, I didn't have it, right? And then I said, which movie I'm going to watch today? Well, I'm in the mood of cartoons. So... Yeah. I searched that information in YouTube because my Roku is not working right now. And uh, well, I switched the Aristocats because I want to watch a cartoons. So I turn it off. I shared the Coke with my husband. I shared the, uh, the popcorn with him as well. And we relax, sh uh, share that, that um, movie together. And after that, we took the dogs out and walk for, with them. That was really nice. I really need it. Yeah. Yeah, I really need it. So sometimes, yeah, what I'm telling you that, Janet, is not just to let you know what I did. It's just sometimes um, my doctor, my friend, said that we need uh, eight hours of work. We need eight hours of relax. <laughs> and also we need eight hours of do something else that does not implicate your brain to think. For example, there are some like we can, he calls lazy activities. That means that odomi activities, like for example, that you use your brain a lot. For example, if you love uh, to decorate something, mm. try to decorate it. In my, in yes. my free time for yes. being relaxed, I, um, I use it to, um, to stay at bed mm -hmm. and do anything. I love that too. And yes, we love that too. Fun. And it's really nice. Sometimes you, you can don't do have it. have TV, anything. But sometimes you just, need to change it. Just rest. If you love, for example, plants, why you don't plant a new one? If you allow to paint, why you don't paint your room? Do mm. any activities. If you like your dogs or your cats, play with them. If you like to do exercise, do it. Mm. Okay, Th those are the activities that you don't use your brain. Mm -hmm. Or if you like, for example, to like do some hand things, like create something, right? Okay, mm -hmm. do it. Those are called in the psychiatrists or in psychology, you call a lazy activities or dummy activities. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes we need to. Yeah. And you know what? You, you feel refreshed after that. You, you can imagine, but I did, and it was really nice. And now I have a lot of energy. <laughs> and my doctor gave yes. me another vitamins to have more energy. <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> That's too much. Whoosh. That's too much. <laughs> right now, guys, I'm I'm not gonna show you right now my room because I'm I'm painting it. Well, I already painted it, but I'm decorating that. I decorate it. I like, asked a friend uh, to print something and put something. So I'm decorating right now. It's it's too early to paint. What? Uh, tulipans or what, what kind of kind of flower is? Oh, it is a uh, series three, or you can oh. say it in Spanish, uh, Arbol de Cerezo. Yeah, I love them. Oh, because my room, it is my relaxed area. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so I, I need to have everything in the in the good <clears throat> way, and also I I put some um, Japanese words. Oh. That it is okay. one says peaceful, the other one says relax, and the other one is like, let me check, equilibration. Mm -hmm. oh, right. <laughs> Three ones. Yes, I will show it to you once. I, I think I will send it to you. How is it going? It haven't been finished, but it's already part of the process right now. But it haven't been finished yet. I hopefully I can finish this um this week, and you will see it everything. Cause I need to paint a river or a lagoon i'm going oh. to do it because i love it i love to paint so hopefully i can do it yes you see i had to change very good so stop talking about me huh. <laughs> <laughs> one more uh, one more pe person here rafael mr herrera how are you like eh, 
<laughs> you know why I pick you? Because my doctor's friend, his one of his, his last name is Herrera. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. Actually, oh, he has. So he uh, is nice and guy. Uh, uh yes, he is. <laughs> it's not because it's my husband. It's my no, it's not my husband. Oh, no, my, no, oh, no, it's my friend. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm going to get in trouble with his wife. Okay, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yes, that is a yeah. Okay, Mr. Herrera, tell us a little bit about yourself and your date, please. Uh well, um, I have a um uh, a busy day. Okay, also you do, okay. Uh, what happened? Yeah, yeah, because uh, my wife and I, mm -hmm. we have a uh, like small business. Oh, okay. It's like, a, it's like a, we, we sell uh, school supplies. Oh, that's great. Yeah, and and so... You need to get in touch with Janet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we have, a, we have a good day today. Good, so it's, that's amazing. It's good because we tell a lot more than we expect. Oh, that's and nice. So it was, we was moving all day, and sometimes I had to make some deliveries. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. but today, I don't make it because I have my car is broken. Ooh. But uh, the mechanic bring me. Uh, he he bring my he bring me back. My car tonight. He brought it. He brought it back. Brought it back. Yeah, yeah. So I got it now. So I think tomorrow I have to make some deliveries so to some some customers. Mm -hmm. um, that's good because uh, right now I don't have a job. Okay, I understand. Uh, yeah, I have two months. Let me see, <laughs> two months, almost two months and a half that I don't have a job. Okay. So I help my wife and the business and we had to sell more because i don't have a job and we need money <laughs> of course to survive exactly so, so it was a nice day it was a good day so you see uh, thanks god yeah god is yeah. blessing you so at least you had yeah. the three meals of the day right yeah <laughs> and i think a cup of coffee and a sweet bread right yeah, I just, I just, I just, I just, I just eat my dinner. I make the dinner because my wife, my wife, she was a little tired. So I make dinner. I make some beans with eggs and I make a cup of coffee, mm. drink a cup of coffee. So it was delicious dinner because I, I made it. <laughs> oh, it's not because you made it, right? You know what? It could be, guys, a simple dinner, like a piece of bread, a yeah. cheese, a beans. Cheese. But if you make it with love, I like I like I like dinner like traditional dinner. Yeah, I like me so, too. Beans, cream, eggs, uh, cheese. It's very modest. Yeah, it doesn't have yeah. to be fancy. Yeah. Yeah, as long yeah. as you, you do it with your with your own with your heart, and for the people that you loved. Yeah. That's what it counts. That's what I make with love, my wife. Ah, <laughs> very good. How many years Matt. you have been married, guys? Uh, we have 13 years. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, oh. with my husband, me too. Yeah, this year we're going to be 15. 15 oh, yeah? years together, yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. So, I think, I hope, well, not, not I hope, I want, we will help. Like that. <laughs> oh, yes. He's a romantic. It is. He's a romantic guy. <laughs> like my uh, husband. <laughs> no, 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 you I'm see, all, all Herreras are romantic because my friend is really romantic too. And I <laughs> you know, know my he... wife, she, <laughs> she some, sometimes she gets a man with me because I'm not romantic. Really? Uh, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, that is, that tonight, is too much tonight. information that we're not supposed to know, <laughs> Mr. Herrera. That is too private. <laughs> no, but when, when I want to do when I, when I want to when I want to do something uh, with her, I do it alone. Mm, of course, of course, like preparing yeah. dinner. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, so but it was a nice day. I yeah, some, it is. I make some exercise. I like to do. Exercise. You did. You did exercises. Yeah, before I get the dinner, I may I make some exercise. So, <laughs> and, and with and... the dinner, you earn those calories back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> but doesn't matter, okay? Fourteen <laughs> year together. Yeah. yeah, we love each other, so that's great. <laughs> oh. uh, that's... 
that as that's what I'm doing almost every day. You know, and I hope I get a job quick because I need it. Yes, of course. And if you continue practicing in it, English. Yeah, yeah, that's what I want. I want to practice my English. I want to improve my English because I have some problems with my grammar. And you'll I've come had, to the right I, person. <laughs> because I will kill you in grammar. Yeah, uh, nice. Look at the handle, it's like, I know, what am I getting to? <laughs> thank you, no, thank it, you, Red. Nice because oh. we need that. We need, yes. we need somebody to... To kill you sometimes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not to, to make you suffer. Nah, just kidding. Yeah, yeah but, but I'm, happy. I'm happy to be here. Me too. I'm, I'm happy to have you and have you all, guys. I'm I want so to say happy. I'm sorry about yesterday Thanks. because mm -hmm. I don't connect to yesterday. Yes. I have some problem with my internet. Okay. I fixed it already. So okay, but that's out. okay. Don't worry. Even though you cannot connect, hopefully you can do it every day, right? But if, for example, something happens like that's the thing that you happened to you, Rafael. Mm -hmm. it, I upload. I upload the um, the videos every single day. Oh, and really? I put yes. I'm going. I don't know if you guys in the email that the the academy sent it to you. You should have the link. Yeah, we have. You do have the link to um to our list. Okay, because each teacher has their yeah. own list. So I upload it every single day. I upload okay. it at night. So to so you can you can check it uh, around twelve or midnight. Or also you can have it by really early morning next day. And okay, I and right. I put it day one, day two, day three. I put all the days, and also I put the dates. Okay. So yesterday, okay. so there already a lot of um, January twenty six, no twenty five, twenty six, and then we're going okay. to have a twenty seventh. So okay. if you cannot be for some reason, just get into the list, check on the video, and you are able to double check it. And after that, you still have a questions, you can ask it in the next class. Okay, okay, thank you. Okay, yeah. cool, excellent. Okay, guys, so did you do your homework? Yep. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> hopefully you do. What was the homework, by the way? A little bit confused for me. Uh -huh. Why? <laughs> uh, the five sentence, I couldn't finish because I, I didn't understand the meaning of the sentence. I know, <laughs> but that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. No problem. Yes. <laughs> that's your, that's your son. Is that your son? <laughs> yeah, I know guys. I know that you couldn't understand the meaning of the sentence and it's because it's really hard, but doesn't matter. I, I will help you. Okay. That's what I'm five. here for. Okay. Let me open it. Okay, so the first one, guys, was basically there were like six sentences, right? That you need to convert uh, from active voice to passive voice, right? Yeah. Using the verb. Yes. Okay, so do me a favor. Uh, Tati, let's start with you. Um, read as what it is. Don't read it the, the answer. No, I, I don't want you to read the answer. I just want you to, um, to read it like the way it is. Uh, sentence number one, please, Tati. Okay, just wait. Just like the way it is. I have to see my. Ah, okay, okay, that's okay. I understand. Okay, just let me. It, the one sentence, uh, number one, is sculptor Frederick August August Bartholdi mm -hmm. decided the Statue of Liberty in. In eighteen, eighteen, eighteen eighty four. Very good, eighteen eighty four. You can say eighteen eighty four or eighteen eighty four, right? Like British. That's okay for me. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> cool. Okay. So Tati, you in that sentence that is the active way, right? That is yeah. the active. In the first part, is telling us. Who did it, right? The Who touch. designed it? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Touch. But in that sentence, do you understand everything? Yeah? Yes, I understand. Okay. I understand. So, so do me a favor. How can you translate this sentence into passive way? And you have to remember, guys, with passive, which auxiliary do we use? Bye. Bye. No, Bye. auxiliary. Auxiliary. Was, was, was or, or where, right? Remember, was. the passive verb to be. 
And mm -hmm. the verb, the main verb. Yeah. In which part? Okay. In past participle. Excellent job. That's what I want. Okay, now Tati, do it. The statue, I. Mm -hmm. How do you re pronounce the statue? The statue? You can say the statue or statue. It's okay. The statue of Liberty in 1884 was designed by a sculptor August Bartholdi. Okay. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. uh, kind of, mm -hmm. because the, the, the year is not there. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, but good try, Tati. Good try. Okay, but very, very good. Let's let's listen what Alex has to say. Go ahead, Alex. In 1884, the Statue of Liberty was designed by sculptor Frederick August Bertoldi. Uh-huh, that's one way. Uh-huh. Any other opinion? Uh, hey, teacher, um, at okay. the end, the year uh, can uh -huh. stay at the end. Okay, what do you have, Mariana? The Statue of Liberty was designed by Frederick August Bartholdi in 1884. That's right. That's the, that's the right way. Mm -hmm. Very good, Ariana. Yes, that's the right way. The, the year has to be at the end all the time. All right. All right. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Uh -uh. Okay. Let's continue. <clears throat> Angel, I know that you want to participate. I oh, listen to your voice. beautiful voice. <laughs> okay, oh, Angel, <laughs> do me a favor. Read it like the way it is, without the answer. Like the way it is, sentence is number two, please. Okay. Daniel Day Lewis played uh, Abraham Lincoln in 2012, film Lincoln. Okay, very good. Now, can you transform it into Pass Away? Okay. Uh, let me see. Uh, like, where, where are this? Like, mm -hmm. can, this uh -huh. one is a little bit uh, not complicated. It's not. It's not too easy. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, it's too easy. Uh, in 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 two thousand twenty two. Okay. <laughs> Recap. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the the film Lincoln in the two thousand twelve. Uh, was was player uh, by Daniel Day Lewis. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you have an idea? Okay. Mm -hmm. And thank you, Angel. Very very good. Good try. Anybody else, Beatrice? Number two. Aha. Uh -huh. mm. What do you have? What is the possible answer that you might have? Um, Abraham Lincoln. I don't mm -hmm, know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm sorry. <laughs> Abraham Lincoln. Uh, no. Mm -hmm. Yes, you can do it. Go it, ahead. It, it, Abraham Lincoln, okay. Abraham Lincoln was played. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. By oh, by uh huh. Go ahead. Was played by Daniel Day uh -huh. Lewis. Uh huh. In the two thousand twelve film Lincoln. Excellent. That's right. Very good. Very good. Thank you. <laughs> you, were like, you were so close, <laughs> like you, like a pig. Oh my god. <laughs> but We're very well, good job. Please. Excellent well. job. Hello. What Who said hello? Alex. Alex. Okay, Mr. Alex. What about if you put the year in the middle? Like, it's because, uh, yes, the year in the middle, but if you said the year was part of the film Lincoln. So mm -hmm. the film Lincoln was in that year. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's why she put it like that. I have like this way. Uh -huh, go ahead. Well, you the, have it. The Abraham Lincoln in 2012 film was played by it. Daniel Day Lewis. Mm. The Haram Lincoln in the 2012 film uh, no, was because... played by Daniel Day Lewis. I got it. I got what you have. But remember that we're talking about the film to uh, Lincoln that it was in 2012. 
year. So that that year it is directly referring to the film Lincoln. Mm -hmm. So that's why she put it like that wish. You got okay. it? Yeah. Okay, cool. Excellent. Number yeah. three. Uh, <clears throat> Miguel Franco. Would you like to participate it? Yes, right? Of course. Yes, of course. Hello, of teacher. course. Yes, of course. Very good. <laughs> Read it like the way it is. Number three. I, ha I have a suggestion for a suggestion. The suggestion for number two. Okay, what well, you have? Okay. The Lincoln film was played by Daniel Day Lewis in 2012 as no sorry sorry the film Lincoln was played by Daniel Day Lewis as Abraham Lincoln in 2012. Not really because remember guys that remember Michael that um that that the Mr. Daniel Day Lewis didn't play the film he played the character or yeah. Abraham him yeah, Lincoln. This is why I say Daniel mm -hmm. Day Lewis as Abraham Lincoln. Mm, aha, but you said the film. Yes, the film. And, and, and it is not the film Lincoln, it's in the film Lincoln. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's why it does why it cannot be possible. Okay. Because he played he played the character of Abraham Lincoln, but not the film Lincoln. That was okay. the name of the film. He played it in 2012, but what he did, Mr. Daniel Day Lewis played the character of one of the president of the United States, Mr. Abraham Lincoln. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's the reason. Yeah, I got, I got your point. But, okay. uh, but what my suggestion, guys, will be that every time that you try to like scramble one, um, one sentence, you need to identify the main parts of the sentence. For example, the yeah. subject. What is the verb? If you're using an auxiliary, if you're not using an auxiliary. Mm -hmm. So what is exactly what they're telling you? And then when you identify the adjectives, the adverbs, etc., then you are able to convert okay. it. And I also yeah. have to say something. Uh, oh. For example, remember guys, let's do some Spanish grammar. I, I am English teacher, but I know Spanish grammar, okay? Okay, just to <laughs> let you know, all right? Okay, yeah, remember guys that adverbs, qualifies the verbs, right? Yeah. And the adjectives qualifies the subject, right? Yeah. But there's some difference in English. For example, adjectives, most of the time, um, in a, I think in Spanish, the adjective goes after the subject, right? Am I right? Yes, we said niña, yes. niña bonita, right? Mm. Yes, but in English, it's the opposite way. It yes. goes before the subject. So all that you got to use to pay attention or where you put it in the, in the order of the sentence. Okay. That's what you have to be careful about. Okay. Okay. Very good. Okay. But good try, okay. Miguel. Okay, Miguel. Okay. Now that we're talking and, and, and talking with you. Okay. But about number three. What you have for number three? Okay. I'll read it. Assist. Yes. Assist. Read it like the way it is and then you convert it. Yes. Okay. Gabriel Garcia Marquez wrote the book 100 Years in Solitude in 1971. Ah, yes, I love that book by heart. Okay, go ahead. Okay. The book 100 Years in Solitude was written by Gabriel Garcia Marquez in 1971. Yeah, good job. Mm -hmm. Woohoo! Mm -hmm. That's my man. Excellent. Congratulations. <laughs> You broke my heart. <laughs> there you go. Excellent job. Yay. Very good. Okay. Juancito, would you like to try, Juancito? Yeah. Do your best, Juancito. Number four, please. Um, who part produced the first digital HDTV in 1991? Very good, excellent. Okay, so how can you transform the sentence into passive voice, Juancito? Uh, the first digital HD TV was produced by who part? Uh -huh. uh -huh. In? In? In, sorry, in 1991. Very good, wow. excellent job, Juancito. Woohoo! You see? Congratulations. <laughs> you broke my heart. Yay. 
Very good, excellent. What about number five? Iris, would you like to try number five? Yes. Okay, go ahead, Iris. Yes. Okay. J.K. Rowling wrote the first Harry book on the old manual typewriter. Mm -hmm. I think so. Uh -huh. The first Harry book was written on old manual typewriter by J.K. Rowling. Mm, that's good. Harry Potter, right? Harry okay. Potter. Very yeah. good. Any other? Um, very good, Iris. Any other suggestion, guys? Oh, you have a good? You no, have a letter the way it is? I get a C. You get a C? Yes, Johnny? I have another type. Okay, okay, Janet, go ahead. Okay, but I don't know if it's correct. I'll do your best. Of the course. first Harry Potter book on a manual typewriter was writing, written by J.K. Rowling. Very good. That's good as well. Okay. What do you have? Do you have the same, Alex? Yeah, I got the, the first Harry Potter book was written on an old manual typewriter by J.K. Rowling. Very good. Excellent. Yes, these are two possibilities are correct. So we're good. Excellent job, guys. Woohoo! Last but not least, letter C, number six, <laughs> who hasn't participated? Marielito, would you like to participate? I, I know she's going to ask me. Huh? Marielito is quiet. OK, go ahead. <laughs> uh, Empire Magazine readers choose the grandfather as the greatest feel of all time. Uh -huh. The godfather. 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 Al Padrino, Godfather. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh, okay. now convert it. The Godfather. Mm, no. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know. Do your best. Uh huh. The Godfather. That's good. Uh, the. Where is the bus party? Uh, I don't know. The or... Godfather. Okay, do me a favor. Remember, Godfather. Godfather is okay. So let me ask you. Godfather is a singular or plural? Marilito? Singular. singular. Okay, singular. exactly. So do you remember that if we want to convert it into passive, we need to use the pass of the verb to be. So what is the pass of verb to be? Yes, I know. Was, uh -huh. but was I very good. Uh -huh. I don't remember was the past participle. Of, of choose. choose. Okay, guys, help her. What is the past participle of choose? Choosing. Choosing. Okay. Chosen. 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 <laughs> Chosen. I chose her, right? Come on. <laughs> Chosen. Okay. Oh, my God. You're going to give me a grammar heart attack today. Come on. Okay. Okay, Marielito. So there you have yeah. your answer. The godfather. Mm-hmm. Was chosen. 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 Yeah, you see, guys? <laughs> Get, bad yeah. example. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, okay. The godfather was chosen. I oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> By the Empire Magazine readers as the greatest field of all time. Yay! Excellent job. That's good. That's my girl. <laughs> what about? Yeah. I could, you got a different. Ah, you got a different. Always, Alex, I got it. Come on, <laughs> Alex, go ahead. <laughs> um, what about if you say the Godfather was chosen? Oh, I'm sorry, chosen mm -hmm. as the greatest film of all the time by the Empire Magazine readers. Very good. Excellent as well. Yeah. Very good. Great job. The two possible answers. Very good. Okay. Excellent, guys. Yay. I'm so happy. Woohoo. Very good. Oh my God. You are so smart. Yeah. Oh. So you yeah. see, guys, passive with bye. That's easy, right? We have a nice teacher. Uh, no, we have a good <laughs> students. I can say that, that we have a really good students. All righty, excellent job, guys. So I'm going to introduce something right now because enough, enough for um, passive with by, right? We're yeah. going to introduce now the passive without by. Okay, I look like a, like a Negro without by. 
Okay, so <clears throat> now guys, I want you to pay attention to a dialogue, okay? I'm gonna, uh, we're going to, every, every class, we're going to get deeply to develop the listening skill because that is one of the skills that is really hard, okay? Okay. So yeah. uh, today uh, we're going to introduce this uh, dialogue is to help us introduce our new topic, which in this case is going to be the passive without why. But I want you guys to pay attention to, first of all, I will try to play it two times. The first mm -hmm. time, I just want you guys to let me know in general, in general, okay, in general, what is the the dialogue about or what had happened okay okay and the second time i will ask you a specific question okay but yes. let me let me let you know something from okay this week is the last time that i'm gonna play the audio two times for okay. next for next week i'm gonna play the audio only one time at least I consider that I had to play it more than once because I need to ask you a lot of questions. But if that is not the case, I'm gonna play it only one time. Teacher, okay. why you do that? Okay, simple. Why I'm doing that? Because I want you to be prepared for now on to uh, also pay your 100% focus and also to develop your skill because guys, when you're going to do the TOEFL and the TOEIC, for example, those are the um, a specialty exams that helps you evaluate your level of English. They will yeah. give you time. They will give you time. And they're not mm. going to wait for you to like uh, answer in your own rhythm. There will be like a hundred, it, it is like 200 um, questions per section. So if you got it, good. If you don't, I'm sorry, but well, you have time to. So I just want you to get used to that, that rhythm from now on. So when you finish and you are going to do the toy, the test, you said, ah, that's an easy, peasy, queasy. Yes, but you had to practice before that. And we're going to start practice little by little. For example, guys, toic, we evaluate four, four things. No, we evaluate two things, the listening and the reading. And it will be around an hour and a half. In an hour and a half, you do the test, okay? And there are simple, simple topics like, for example, going to the barbershop, going to the zoo, going to a museum, etc. But in the TOEFL, we evaluate the four skills. And if you start doing your exam at 7 a.m., you're going to finish at 1 p.m. My God. Yes. And the... Um, the topics or the readings, they're like a high college level, for example, talking about astrology, astronomy, economy, etc. right? So we're going to start developing all the skills right now because sometimes you will face something that you don't know the meaning, right, Tati? Like what happened to you? But you're going to learn, guys, that even though you do not know that all the meanings of an article or all the letter words of a sentence, but I will help you and I will uh, teach you how to understand the information, even though it's not your area. Okay. Yes, that's why we're going to start doing all the things. We're going to develop mm -hmm. the reading, the listening, etc. Because in writing, for example, in TOEFL, um, they, for example, they are to do have to do two essays. One essay is to pick uh, any article, for example, tattoos. What the, the, the writer says something about his opinion about tattoos. Okay, that's an example. And then you have to make an essay uh, saying that you agree with what, what the writer said or you're not agree. That's one. And in the second essay, you pick a topic and then you do your own essay. And it's supposed to be in four paragraphs. So we evaluate their grammar, vocabulary, linking works, etc. And if that is the, one of the most parts that everybody fails. So that's Ooh. why it's really important that you get used to for now on. So that's why the rules will be this week, two times. Next week, one time. Got it? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So 100% exactly. concentration, all right? 
<laughs> oh, okay. Don't worry, guys. Don't don't be a scare, uh, Janet. Okay. Please don't be a scare, Janet. I try to do to to do better than you can. Okay. Yeah, you don't have to be scared with me. Don't be panic. <laughs> don't be panic. Yeah, yeah, exactly. No, Janet, it's going to be so much fun. Okay. 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 Yes, that's what you're saying. Okay. So mm -hmm. yeah. uh, let me check if this is the one. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes, that's the one that I need. <laughs> Okay, so let me share right now my screen with you. And then we're going to discuss this. Okay, okay. This is the introduction for our new topic, guys. Tell me if you're able to see, to listen. Page 75. Yes. Ex yes. yes. Okay, cool. Size eight. Conversation. I need some information. Part A. Listen. I need some information. What currency is used in the European Union? Where? The European Union. I think the euro is used in most of Europe. Oh, right. And is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Huh. Well, what about credit cards? Are they accepted everywhere? How would I know? Well, you're a travel agent, aren't you? What? This is a hair salon. You have the wrong number. Okay, guys. No. So, that might happen to us right here. What happened? <laughs> what happened? What? What? Did you understand the dialogue? Yes? Yeah. Okay, yeah. so tell me, guys, yeah. what had happened in general? What is the dialogue about? Well, he was calling to the some information to get information exactly get yeah. information about what For card uh huh the, the card. Uh, Europe the Europe the Europe the Europe Euro. 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 beautiful salon okay very good so uh, travel tra okay. he is going to travel he's going to travel he where some information uh huh uh, Europe. European Europe. Union uh huh Union. American Union, Union. Union. Exactly. So he's going to travel to Europe. He needs some information about it. He asked for the language, right? Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. What else he asked for? For the they credit accept cards. credit cards. Credit the cards. Currency. Very good, Jenny. And what else? The currency. The currency. The currency. The currency. The cur that means yes, the yes. money. Yes. Right. The currency is the money. And yeah. oh, exactly. So and he's asked that because in his mind, where he was calling to. To travel agency. Travel agency, travel agency like but at the end, where he was calling. Agency. How am I going to know? <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. We're like, Oof. now do me a favor. Uh, now, guys, in the second uh, listening, I want you guys to pay attention on um, one thing. I want you guys um, to pay attention on the way she um no on the first question that the guy said ask for and on the first answer for example when she said where in the european union i want you to pay attention in these two parts okay okay all right okay. so let me okay one more time i want to know that mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay Page 75, exercise eight, conversation. I need some information. Part A, listen and practice. Hello? Oh, hello. I need some information. What currency is used in the European Union? Where? The European Union. I think the Euro is used in most of Europe. Oh, right. And is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Huh. Well, what about credit cards? Are they accepted everywhere? How would I know? Well, you're a travel agent, aren't you? 
What? This is a hair salon. You have the wrong number. Okay. So, the first question that the guy said is, hello, oh, hello, I need some information. Uh, what currency? What currency is what? What did he say? Houston. Uh-huh. Houston in the European Euro. Union. Uh-huh, yes. Euro? What Euro. currency is used in the European, you said, right? Yes. yes. European Euro. Union. Okay, take a look. I sent it to you right now on the chat. Take a look of the structure. It's used. Yes. It's really interesting, right, guys? Because we have the bird to be there, but in present, right? We are. But we have the main verb in past. It's really interesting. Okay. That's the first thing. She continued, right? Talking and everything, blah, 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 blah. And then she said, where? The, Euro the European Union. Yeah. And then she made her opinion, right, about, about it. She said, I think that Euro is used in the most of Europe. Well, that's what she said, right? I think. Yes, she thinks. I think the Euro, so Euro, yeah. is most used. Yes, that's what she said. Let me check it out. It's, no, it's used in, in most of Europe. Yes. Mm -hmm. There you go. Let me write it the second sentence. All right. So take a look. One is a question and one is an answer. But both of them has the same structure. Why? It's interesting, right? Okay, guys, I'm going to send you right now the dialogue. And we're going to practice it, right? <laughs> but try to get into the character, you know? Okay, I think, Alex, it would be really good. Like, I'm calling to the, am I calling to the uh, agency? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, uh, so I'm yeah, going yeah. to pick one girl and one boy, okay? <laughs> okay, so let me send right now the dialogue. Please just allow me one minute. There you go. Okay. I will send it through the WhatsApp, guys, and let me know as soon as you're able to receive it. Here you go. Okay. Okay. Did you guys receive it? Yes? Yes. Yay. Yes. First victim, oh, sorry, <clears throat> first, first yes. participant, may I apologize? Okay. Uh, let me check. Uh, Rafael. Yes. Would you like to be the guy who's calling for information about Europe? Yes, right? Yeah, okay. John. Yes. John, right? Yes, okay, so you're going to be John, and who's going to be the hair salon girl? Let me check. Mm -hmm. Rachel, would you like to be it? Yeah. <laughs> I yes. knew it. Okay, but I want to see your face because you need to, like, use your cell phone and everything like that, like, get into the character, you know? Like, if you're doing the live thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I want to see your, you said... You're calling to the right salon, right? Okay, like that. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Tell me when you're ready. I am ready. Okay, okay but I want I want to see your let's face, but if it's possible. Okay. 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 Hello. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh, yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. And I need some information. And scenario number two. Action. Go ahead. Hello. Oh, hello. I hey, 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 stop, 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 stop. Mm -hmm. Rafael, where is your cell phone? You're calling. <laughs> Rafael, do you have your cell phone yeah. with you? Or no? Yes, I have. Where yes, is I it? Have my cell. it? Are you using it right now? Okay, so that I want you to use your cell phone. Like if you're making a phone okay. call, okay? Go ahead, okay. <laughs> yeah, I need some information. Action, go ahead, Kelly. Hello. Oh, hello. I need some information. 
What currency is using you in the Europe Union? Where? The Europe Union. I think the Europe is used in most of Europe. All right. And is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Oh, well, what about credit cards? Are they accepted everywhere? How will I know? Well, you are a travel agent, are you? What? This is a hair salon. You have the brown number. Hey, very good. Very good. <laughs> and I like when Rachel said, what? Yes. Hey, you had the wrong number. Very good. <laughs> Excellent. Congratulations. Thank good you. job. <laughs> Second pair of big tunes. Sorry. Alejandro. Yay. Yeah. And Nor Noria, would you like to be the hair salon girl? Yeah, right. I cannot hear you. You need to turn your micro your, your microphone on. Very good. Okay. Good evening. Good okay. evening, Noria. So you're going to be Kelly and Mr. Alejandro Playtest is gonna be John. Okay. Okay. Okay, I need some information. Action, please. Hello. Alejandro. Oh, hello. I need some information. What currency is used in the European Union? Where? The European Union. I think the euro is used in most of Europe. Europe. All right. And is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Uh, well, what, what about credit cards? Are they accepted everywhere? How will I know? Well, you're a travel agent, aren't you? What? What? This is a higher salon. You have the wrong number? Very good. Excellent. <laughs> hey, but I want to see your face, Alejandro. You didn't have your cell phone with you, right? Uh -huh. Yeah, that, that, that's a problem. <laughs> that's okay. Uh, I didn't believe him. Uh, no, I'm that's okay. Yeah. Very good. Excellent. Last but not least, yeah. Juancito, would you like to participate in being Mr. John? <laughs> yes, right? Okay, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah. When the sister asking you, there's no choice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. But I answer for you, Juancito. Okay. And Mariana, would you like to be Kelly? Yes. Yay, finally. She said, yes. finally. Okay, go ahead. I need some information in scenario number four. Action. Action. Hello. Okay. Oh, hello. I need some information. What currently is used in the Europe Union? Where? The Europe Union. I think the euro is used in most of Europe. All right. And is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. <laughs> uh, well, what about credit card? Are they accepted everywhere? How will I know? Well, you're a travel agent, aren't you? What? This is a hair salon. You have the wrong number. Very good. Excellent. Yay. Excellent job. Very good, guys. Good participation. <laughs> just just let's, let's, let's practice some vocabulary, okay? Some words yes. that we need to like develop in the pronunciation. For example, the first intervention with John, when the, he's asking the first question, uh, repeat after me, currency. Currency is used, 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 used in the used. European Union. European Union. Very good. Then in Kelly, we have the arrow. 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 Is used in most of Europe. 
is used in most of Europe. Is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. I really have, have no idea. idea. Yeah. Yeah. idea. Huh. 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 No eyes. <laughs> like, a, hmm. like that, right? When you don't believe it. Hmm. Like that. That is the expression. Huh. You you do that expression like, hmm. I don't believe this guy. Don't believe this girl. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> exactly like that. <laughs> okay. Well, what about credit cards? Well, well, what about, well, what about well, credit cards? Are they accepted everywhere? Are they accepted everywhere? Everywhere. And this guy's, the Kelly is asking something, but like, this guy, what is he asking, right? How would I know? How would I know? How would I know? How would I know? I know. Look, the, look the emphasis and look the feeling that what she said. How would I know? Yeah. Okay. Well, you're a travel agent, aren't you? Like, you silly girl. You're a travel agent, aren't you? <laughs> exactly. Like, yeah, that, that, yeah, that's the tone of boy he uses. Uh, what? <laughs> this is a hair salon. You had the wrong number. What? What? This what? is a hair salon. You have the wrong number. Yes, guys. That Think about, guys, when you receive a phone call and you don't know the person and you don't know why the person is calling you, like, what? What is this person? Everybody has happened that it has passed to that situation, right? Like, what the yeah. heck is going on? Yeah, so basically, it's exactly <laughs> the same. Like, so that will help you guys to get into the character because I want you guys, uh, we do this role plays not only to also help you co correct pronunciation of questions or words, etc. Also, guys, this helps you to sound more natural and our staff sound like robots. What do you want me to do with it? No way. No. <laughs> you gotta speak like a fluently way, yeah? How would I know? Yeah. Huh. Well, you are a travel agent, aren't you? Like that. Okay. Yeah, that's why we're practicing that. Right now is the first time, and we're getting like um, I don't know how to say that. We're we're getting used to the words and also the information of the dialogue, etc. Right? Because it's the first time that we saw this information. But tomorrow we're going to do again this practice and i'm going to pick another victim sorry another another participant okay. <laughs> i will all pick right. them all two pairs another pairs and i want you guys to your homework today will be to practice practice the dialogue by your own okay. again practice practice and tomorrow we're going to do this first and then okay. we're going to get into deeply what we have introduced right now which is passive without buy Okay. 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 Any questions? Okay. Any doubts? So far, so good. Easy yeah. peasy queasy. Yeah, nice. Yes. Yeah. 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 Nice. All right. Nice, nice. Okay, guys. So I hope nice. you enjoyed today's class. Thank you so much for being here. It's a pleasure to see you yeah. every day in class. <laughs> Hi. Thank you for your big haunt. All righty. Okay. Enjoy your meal for the ones that haven't had yeah. your dinner. Yeah. Okay. Hugs. And kiss us. Yeah. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye everyone. See you tomorrow.